trying to get Khaleesi to eat some crickets. I've caught one right here. And because she's not really going after them, I'm going to see if maybe she'll eat the one I caught. Got to move her back some. Move back a little baby. You ain't got no room. Here, here, here. Look what mommy has. Look what mommy has. And it's hard to do it with having the camera and having one hand. Baby, look. Baby. And I'm going to be bringing the baby tango out in a little bit too hopefully he's not he she is not still too uh traumatized to eat here eat one of these you like these you like these she hasn't had them in a while so she might not know what to do with them she used to just go crazy and start eating them like nuts but she doesn't seem to be that interested in them right now I'm going to let her sit there for a little while with them and see if maybe she starts eating them. If she starts trying to get out of the cage, I'm going to have to let her out and put her back in her cage. And she can eat her veggies that I just put in there for her. I'm going to pause this and get the baby and hopefully the baby will be okay with eating. Okay, I have Tango. He was hanging out on his wall or he or she, we won't know for a few months. And... Khaleesi's starting to act like she wants out of there, so let's see. I'm going to have to put Tango in here and drop a couple crickets in. Hopefully he'll be okay. She'll be okay. Do you want out, Khaleesi? Do you want out? Make sure there's no crickets on you. Okay. She's out. Now, don't go running off. No running off. Try to stay up here with mommy. You have to build a fence so she stays up here. And then we're going to go ahead and just drop one or two if I can in Tango's cage. Here, look at Tango. Oh, shit. Look what I just did. Crickets everywhere. I dropped, I hit the, the thing and the cricket's just going everywhere. The little crick, or little lizards out here will be very, very, very happy. They are everywhere. Oh my gosh. I'm glad I had a lot in here because otherwise she wouldn't be eating right now. So, yeah, so there's one, two, three, and one just jumped on me. There he goes. Don't do it. I'm using the phone to perk it back in. These things are fast. Really fast. You open up the lid and you gotta be careful because they're like on it. They're ready to go. And me knocking it over didn't do any good. Look, there's still one over here just cruising along like life's little highway. Did they get to you, baby? Did they come to you? There was a bunch of them. I am imagine there's going to be a lot of little lizards very happy because they usually line up over here when I feed him, her, because I drop one or two. But this time I dropped about 20. Look, in my welcome mat right here beside me, they're freaking everywhere. All right, back to the beautiful tango. They're not even moving, so... Eat the lizard, or eat the crickets, baby. I had to feed her hand feeder the last time. I may have to do that again. All right, I got one. Look what I got. Look, yummy. She might not want to eat because last time she ate was when she got lost. So she might associate that with getting lost. Eat it. Eat it, baby. Come on, you gotta eat. Yeah, I don't like them either. They're kind of creepy, huh? But... I uh, ripped his leg off. Khalees is just sitting here watching. He's 
try one more. Well, let me grab one. Probably the one I already ripped his leg off of. There you go. There you go. Eat him. Eat him. Come on. He's got his eyes closed. He's like, I am not eating him. Come on, baby. You gotta start. You gotta eat. It's a cricket. You like crickets. to catch again, I guess. I don't know. I think I'm going to give her a break in here with the crickets. So, that's how our day is going. Khaleesi won't eat her crickets, and Tango won't eat his or her crickets. Um, hopefully, that'll change. I'll give them about 10-15 minutes to rest with them, and then we'll try again. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.